Towers where we've been given exclusive access for the rebirth of one of the world's most loved roller coasters. Now, testing is underway on one of the country's most famous roller coasters, which has undergone a major revamp. Nemesis at Alton Towers in Staffordshire closed in November 2022 after running for nearly 30 years. Now, as part of its overhaul, the entire 716-metre-long track has been replaced. Ben Sidwell has been given an exclusive look behind the scenes. After 18 months in hibernation, today one of the world's favourite roller coasters roared back into life. Nemesis has been completely rebuilt and taken on a brand new look. And after a year and a half of hard work, many of those involved gathered to watch as the cars took to the track for the very first time. It feels absolutely incredible. I mean, what a milestone um, to be here today to actually see it. So it was so incredibly important for us to bring it back to, to you know, to Nemesis Reborn um, and to give it new life for generations, for new generations of thrill seekers that are going to come to the park. Well, the entire track of Nemesis is absolutely brand new and so are the cars as well, although a tiny bit of the old ones have been recycled in them. As for the testing, well, that will now continue until Nemesis reopens to the public later this year. Nemesis originally opened in 1994, but after almost 30 years of operation, the ride was coming to the end of its life. So Alton Towers had to decide whether to get rid of it or reinvent it. As someone who grew up with Nemesis, as passionate about both the nostalgia of it, but also the future of bringing it back to life, having Nemesis reborn uh, for the 2024 season, I'm super proud to be part of that and to also make sure that I put my utmost into delivering the best it can possibly be. Like every new ride, Nemesis will have to go through a meticulous testing regime, running thousands of times through different scenarios before anyone is allowed to ride on it. She's obviously shedded her skin, so you know it's nice to see it come back alive. We've made some advancements in the in the running rails so that we've we've quieted the runner rails down to be of a smoother experience through there, but as we've seen today, the, the roar is definitely still there. The original ride travelled over 800,000 miles during its life, the equivalent of 32 times around the world, and carried more than 52 million people. It's hoped when Nemesis Reborn opens, it will be just as popular for generations to come. Ben Sidwell, BBC Midlands.